Today I'll talk about how to install correctly the propellers on Ishin E58. You can't install propellers in any order. The order should go according to which way the electrical motors rotate. And uh, just quickly, all propellers are numbered. And for those who doesn't want to understand the logic of working propellers, I'll just tell you that uh, in front, the propellers on the right have code B4. On the left, it's code coded as A2. At the rear part, it's coded as B4. And on the right, rear part, it's coded as A4. And for those who want to understand the logic of how it works, imagine you had to disassemble the propellers and forgot to mark them. And you put them back and the drone doesn't fly up. It's because you just uh, messed up with the propellers. And actually, if you look at the propellers, you can see that the propeller here, the rear one on the right, has blades located in that this way. And if you look at this propeller, instead of having this position, it has this position. And it's due to electrical motors rotating in various directions. Let's check in which direction uh, the propellers are turning. So you can see that this propeller is rotating this way. This propeller is rotating that way. This propeller is rotating this way. And this propeller is rotating, rotating that way. If you notice, the blades on these two propellers have the same position. This one's like this, and this one's like this. And these ones also have blades in the same position and if we know if, if you look at how the electrical motor is rotated these two electrical motors rotated this way and these two electrical motors rotated that way and this is why the letters on these propellers are the same i guess so these two have letter b and they are number four so they are marked as b4 these two but these ones are marked as this one is a4 and this one is marked as A2, which is a bit strange. But we don't need to know those codes, because if you know how the propellers work and in which direction the electrical motors are rotating, you can put the propellers in the correct order. So the blades, uh, imagine that this is the blade and uh, it's rotating. If, if, if you have position in this way, and it's rotating this way, then the air will be pushing on the blade and will, will be pushing it upwards. So imagine my hand is in air, it flows, hits the blade and the, blow, the blade goes up. Imagine the blade is located this way, so if it hits the air, it will go down. You will need the propellers in that way that its blades will be pushed by the air upwards. So we know that uh, these propellers are rotating in a counterclockwise direction and when it's rotating in the counterclockwise direction you see the blade here is positioned this way so it's rotating in counterclock direction and the blade is located like this so we will go up the hair is hitting the blades and it will go up same for this one, it will rotate like this, and the blades are located in the, this position, so it will be pushing the blade up. So these two arms will be pushed up, and we know that these two are getting in a clockwise position, and thus the blades here are positioned this way which means when it will be rotating that this way it will push it up same for this one it's rotating in the clockwise direction and the blades are looking like that will be pushing up the propellers so if you push up the propellers you will push up the drone 
and also if you think that your propellers are bad or damaged and this is why it's not taking off check the position of propellers first I'd say that I have really bad uh, blades on my propellers right now uh, the plastic is gone in some parts for example here the plastic is really gone and in some places the here the blade is deformed actually and it's still flying fine I mean I've hit this drone into walls many times this drone took off from rough surfaces sand hitting the blades against stones and sand and it's still flying I have not replaced any of the propellers yet and it's working fine